Hello everyone, thank you for tuning in to the Creative Council. My name is Natasha. Today we're going to be discussing the topic of Christmas and Christmas trees and what they mean in a dream. So like I always say in a video, you want to take into consideration the um, what it means, the meaning of something and its functionality in society or um, and how God created it or intended it. So Christmas is a celebration of what? Christ. Christ must, right? And it literally is a cel it means celebration. So if you're having a dream and it's like Christmassy and it's like decorate decorations, it could be a time showing you a time of celebration, of rejoicing, of hope. Um, it could be an uh, indication of um, benevolence or good deeds. So an invitation for you to bless someone. Um, for surprises, it could be a representation of surprises, a time, a season stamp. So let's say you have a dream of Christmas and it's the middle of you know, April or June, then that is going to be in relation to celebration, a time of rejoicing or whatnot. So uh, it, it could be a time stamp um, and uh, just letting you know that that time of celebration and joy is coming um, for you. And um, it could be also a representation of just receiving God's love and receiving his gifts. And the greatest gift he gave us is Jesus, right? So receiving that gift and celebrating it, um, receiving spiritual gifts and just gifts in general, um, and also a piece, the peace of God to us. So um, even when the angel said to uh, in uh, Matthew, uh, peace and goodwill to man, so it was peace of God and goodwill to man, not good goodwill among us, like, you know, us being good to each other, although we should be, but literally the peace of God, God has made peace with mankind. So it could be a representation of peace, God's peace towards us. Um, now on the negative side, and usually pe people won't think about that, it could be a representation. Let's say you're having a dream about Christmas and you're running through the mall or you're running around and you're shopping, you're buying all these things and it could be a representation of commercialism and that you need to, um, or selfishness, and you're missing the point of Christmas there. So um, if that's the case, you want to pay attention to the details um, and what God is saying. So what about a Christmas tree? A Christmas tree is a evergreen. So an evergreen is a type of tree that it, it um, has foliage all year round. It does not um, you know, stop being green. It doesn't stop producing. So it's everlasting. So it could, I've seen it represent, a Christmas tree represent um, a type of the Jesus. Not saying it represents that, but in a dream it could represent a type of Jesus. Um, depending on elements, you know, that's been a, the case in uh, some dreams in the past, not mine, but um, just in general of uh, dreams that have been interpreted. Um, it could be a representation. A tree is going to be a representation of a leader. So that's why I was saying, you know, everlasting. God is everlasting. Jesus is everlasting. And a celebration of a leader. So uh, it could be a representation of God wanting to honor or his favor on a specific person or specific leader in a season. So Jeremiah uh, 17, 8 talks about a tree um, being, being planted. He is like a a tree planted by streams of water who will not um, fear, but his leaves will be green and moist because his, his roots go down into the river. Um, you can look up the scripture or whatnot, because I'm not going to read the whole thing. But it talks about, uh, it's, it's a representation of a person or a person who's connected to God, the river, the waters, and it's, it's evergreen. So all year round, it will not lack. So it could be a representation of just no lack and God's favor on a, a leader or favor on a godly person and someone who's connected to him specifically. Um, and so let's see, you see uh, gifts under a Christmas tree. Well, that's you or someone receiving a uh, specific leader receiving um, a reaping of what uh, of what God wants so reaping a harvest and reaping um, just what God wants to give them in that season so uh, a se it's just a season of favor anyways so that's typically kind of what um, is going to mean um, now don't this is not in concrete you always want to seek the lord it always you know god speaks to each dreamer in their own language so if christmas is a sore spot for you if it's you know something that you're not really into then 
you know, you want to take things like that into consideration, but typically it's going to be a time of celebration, joy, um, and, um, and benevolence and good deeds and uh, gifts and um, receiving of gifts and giving of gifts in God's favor. So anyhow, I hope that was helpful. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and I will see you in the next video. Till next time, be healed, be whole, be free. Bye.